the Movie Man here for the Final Cut and We Live Film. And I'm with the two gentlemen behind the film we just watched, Billy Club. Now, uh, in the Q&A, you guys mentioned a little bit of your influences as far as uh, coming up with it. Uh, what horror movies would you say uh, influenced the script, though? I know you had the idea of the baseball, but like for setting it in the 90s, what made you want to set it in kind of the 90s and the 80s? Well, I think we both love Halloween and Evil Dead. Um, I don't know what even is Jason a little. I mean, I, to be honest, like I was watching Jason and like thinking about like hockey, and I, for whatever reason, I got on this sports tangent in my head, and I'm like thinking about weird sports. I'm like, everything looks stupid. Like, what what can you do? And then I thought about baseball, but I was like thinking about normal baseball. I'm like, oh, how, how does that look scary? That's weird. And then I was like, well, the umpire is kind of scary. And then I was like. Oh, man. And I started looking antique umpire's masks online. I was like, oh, yeah, now we're getting somewhere. It's got leather. It's weird. It's creepy. And kind of went from there. Plus, you get the whole nostalgic thing. You play as a kid. comes back later. I think that the team, you're kind of forcing these teams. So it just sort of lends itself really nicely to the slasher genre, in my mind. Yeah. Well, it definitely was well put together. Now, uh, you guys did Blood Junkie, which I, I love Blood Junkie as well. Were you, was that a learning experience, and, and did that help you in the production, or is every production a new experience for you? Well, yeah, I mean, you always learn things. I think that that's what makes um, people grow as filmmakers, is to just always learn something new. I, after doing Blood Junkie, I was like, all right, we already did a feature. This is going to be a piece of cake. We've already done this know what I'm in for and it's a whole new list of lessons learned for sure and then we actually did another one that you saw the trailer for ahead of time called Pester and that's another one that is a new list of lessons it just seems you know every time you throw yourself in a different situation you're going to learn new things and you just keep getting better that's what we do so well that's the thing I mean it we always just call it a stepping stone. It's a stepping stone to the next one. The budget gets a little bigger. Production value gets a little better, hopefully. you know. And as long as we're, we feel like we're improving in some realm, uh, I don't know, I feel like it's a success. Awesome. And uh, why don't you plug real quick where they can find out more information. Now, I know it's not available yet for purchase because you're working on some things, but where can they find the merch and more information about Blood, uh, about, well, Blood Junkie, but also about um, Billy Club? Well, um, yeah, we have t-shirts and everything we're working on the sound design and we're just trying to lock in our distribution still we have a few interested parties but we're trying to weigh it all out make sure we get the best deal possible so dvds are on hold for a moment but all the uh merchandise is on billyclubmovie.com and you can also go to bloodjunkie.com and find blood junkie stuff but and uh, just one final question. <laughs> You've got another character. We've seen you twice tonight now. One's in Don't Go to the Reunion and one's here. And both involve alcohol. Uh, <laughs> are you feeling like you're going to be typecasted? <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, these guys just think I'm really good at drinking. You know, I know I am, so I cast myself as a really good drinker. But turns out other people know how good I can drink as well, so, or as well as I can drink as good. I'm not sure. I've already had a few drinks tonight. <laughs> And, and I will say that theme song at the end, you should release that as a single for, for download, 99 cents on iTunes. People would buy that. That's like your new theme song. Drinking I think. is a friend of mine. Yeah, that's a classic. This guy, he's, he's a good artist. Yeah, definitely. Well, thank you, gentlemen. I'll let you go. Go have fun. and thank you. Great movie. Thanks.